on one of my private. <laughs> Let's go. Wow. Alright guys, it's Monday morning. Four things. One, had a great weekend. Two, Friday got my hair cut. I know I'm looking fresh. Three, got a lot of work to to jump into first thing this morning. But four, I also want to share with you guys how I plan on upgrading this year to a full stack engineer. Let me show you. The thing with front end, back end, doesn't matter what you're working on, you need to obviously have the skills. And the easiest way to get the skills is to go out and teach yourself or have someone else teach you or just work in an environment where people are using those skills. Oh, that's hot. And so the kind of catch 22 that I have right now, I want to learn these new skills. I've also got a full time job and this YouTube thing on the side. When do I have time to learn these things? And I think the easiest solution to that is not overthinking it. When I taught myself, I just did stuff in my spare time on the weekends and in the evenings and whenever I had some spare moments. If you do want to level up, if you do want to learn a new skill, you really start prioritizing learning those skills. It sounds really, really basic and clear when I say it out loud, but I don't think it's that obvious to many people. My plan for this year, number one, figure out all the different frameworks my company are using for all backend tech. Number two, Two, I'm gonna find out which one is predominantly used the most, which I have an idea, how they're using it. Then what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna find free online resources, so YouTube or anywhere else that you drop your stack. Back to this. And I think, personally, building projects is one of the easiest ways to learn anything in software development. It kind of forces you into problems and situations you wouldn't come across if you were just simply following a tutorial. So yeah, that's my plan. Six to 12 months. And most importantly, I really want to be able to contribute more than I already am on the back end side of things to my team. Not only makes me more valuable, it probably makes me earn more money. It's just going to mean that I have more opportunity going forward in my company, which is really, really exciting. So yeah. <laughs> Now that we've cleaned that up, let's go quickly clean the office out. Comfort light. Oh yeah, by the way, if you're new here, this is my dog Herman. Say hello to everyone. Mainly the United States, India, Germany, Brazil, and the UK. But also everyone else. Thank you so much for watching. Let's get our Grove made. Super, super miserable day today. All right, so I'm just going to address a couple of comments on one of my pull requests online, and then I'll see you guys very shortly when we kick off the first meeting for the day. Oh, hang on. All right, meeting just ended. And I just realized that I did actually want to be in the city. One of our lead investors who's going to be in the office this morning. So it's really good for us to kind of like be in there and show face. There's some of the work we've been working on. So uh, yeah, I've actually just packed up my bag during that meeting. Just gone onto iPhone mode. And yeah, we're going to head straight in. Oh, one last thing before I forget. Someone commented on my last video, what kind of switches are on your mechanical keyboard? They are cherry blue switches. So yes, very loud, very clacky. Some sort of outsized return. Go raise that from LPs. But Department of Financial Protection and Innovation of the State of I am up on a street that I don't normally park in, and it just happens to be raining. Great. I'll go and find everyone now. Wait, I've just just gotten into the office. Good, bro. I've um I've just done the run. Bro, it's a 24 minute driving. Really? Yeah. Oh shit, oh, yeah. I think it's 10 o'clock. Oh, is that even possible legally? No, like. <laughs> yeah, I'm definitely going to coffee. It's one oh, more. upstairs? Yeah. Oh, I'm gonna go have a look. No. Okay, I'm gonna go jump right now. Yeah, yeah. I'm keen yeah. to jump on that graph for us though. It sounds amazing. Always good. Pretty sick. Yeah, it's pretty cool.
three o'clock. It has been hours and hours. Okay, it's still really noisy out here. Let me tell you guys the rest when we get in the car. A ton of meetings right out of the gate. We've got a whole lot of brand new work that has kind of just sprung into action that is really, really exciting. Myself and a colleague of mine are getting to kind of lead up. Funnily enough, I was talking about leveling up back in full stack side of things. This brand new project is going to help me right into that, which is really, really cool. I'm out of breath. I've been doing this like workout thing for seven days already. There was one last piece of work that I needed to get finished today um, for a previous project. They needed some changes done, so got all that sus for them, created a pull request, been approved, so all is good. I think I'm going to head home and I'm going to do my workout. Got to be done, so might as well do it. And just one last thing, I'm not an expert in anything to do with software engineering or development. I am just someone who is really keen, really interested, and I love learning, and I'm having a lot of fun in this whole tech space. So what I do is not necessarily what you should do. If there's anything I can put out there, fun, positive vibes, inspiration, but by all means, do not copy me because I am no expert. Now let's go do a workout. Oh my goodness, you did not, <laughs> Hermie, 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 did you eat all the treats, did you eat Decent. Damn. All right, well, that is eight days done. Not bad. Decent. As always, guys, hope you enjoyed. Just kidding, we've got day two. Let's go. Okay. I just thought it's a whole lot more exciting sometimes going into the city, especially when I can see my friends. It's also a really nice day today, so yeah, should be fun. So nice. It is such a good day. Coffee time. This is so jelly today, Yum. So something that I should mention as well is yesterday's video was a lot of, I don't know, what would you call it, answering questions from the comments. So I guess I did cover more of like just talking to you guys and answering some questions rather than giving a day in the life of a software engineer. But today I'm going to make more of an effort to show you guys a general day in the life of a software engineer and to start it off. Right now, it is 8.43 a.m. and I have decided, yes, I'm gonna drive in for a second day in a row because I like my friends at the office. So, <laughs> let's go. Whoa. That was crazy. Luckily, I didn't smash the screen. And if you can remember that while you're... Focus. Um, straight into the stream coming up. Um, so yeah, got all that done yesterday, submitted the PR, and um, it's all been approved, so. I gotta get through so I'll leave it right here thank you guys for watching as always if you're a developer make sure you subscribe and I'll see you guys soon